Meghan boiling with rage as Harry secretly gave $9,860 gift for nephew Prince Louis. He's just released his own tome, but it seems Prince Harry was already a book lover before becoming an author. The Wayward Royal, 38, reportedly gifted nephew Prince Louis with a first edition copy of A. A. Milne's Winnie the Pooh. There are only 30,000 first edition copies of the 1926 children's classic in existence, according to the Mirror, with Harry forking out a cool $9,860 for the present. The thoughtful gift was said to have been inspired by Princess Diana, who collected first edition copies of her favorite books. One of Harry's happiest childhood memories was being read a bedtime story by his mother, a source told the publication. She loved all the old classics and Harry had the brilliant idea of starting a little library of first editions for Louis, and his siblings, Charlotte and George to enjoy as they get older. He originally wanted to get Lewis Carroll's Through the Looking Glass, which was on sale for $29,000, but decided Winnie the Pooh would be more suitable for a first tome, the insider added. Robinson Crusoe was William's favorite book, but Harry loved all things A. A. Milne. Harry's brother, Prince William, and sister-in-law, Princess Skate, were reportedly thrilled by the thoughtful gift for their youngest son. The family-friendly Milne book is a far cry from Harry's naughty new memoir Spare, which is chock-full of raunchy revelations, including details of how he lost his virginity in a field to an older woman who treated him like a young stallion. It would be another 18 months before the couple spectacularly split from the royal family in a move dubbed Megixed. Before then, it seems, Harry and Meghan both had a reputation as stellar gift givers. In 2016, Meghan gifted William with a witty novelty gift for Christmas. The Suits star had the words serial killer engraved on a spoon for the future king, who was reportedly humored by the punny present. Prince Harry is anxious to reconcile with brother Prince William following years of estrangement, but he knows it will take a lot for that to happen. In his sit-down interviews with ITV and 60 Minutes, both of which aired today, the Duke of Sussex gets emotional when speaking of his strained relationship with his sibling and father, King Charles III. I love my father, I love my brother, and I love family, Harry tells ITV. I don't think my father or brother will read the book, but what they have to say to me and what I have to say to them will be in private, and I hope it can stay that way. He also tells 60 Minutes that the reason he is speaking out about his brother, father, and the rest of his family, is to set the record straight on what has been said about him, not to offend them or paint them as enemies. Though he admits he hasn't spoken to William or King Charles in a while, and certainly doesn't see himself ever returning as a senior member of the royal family, Harry says he's looking forward to him and William being able to find peace in the near future. My brother and I love each other. I love him deeply. There has been a lot of pain between the two of us, especially the last six years, Harry says. The prince also wants to stand by his wife, Duchess Meghan, who many have accused of forcing him to cut ties with his family and abandon his royal upbringing for her. children's classic in existence, according to the Mirror, with Harry forking out a cool $9,860 for the present. 
The thoughtful gift was said to have been inspired by Princess Diana, who collected first edition copies of her favorite books. One of Harry's happiest childhood memories was being read a bedtime story by his mother, a source told the publication. She loved all the old classics and Harry had the brilliant idea of starting a 